you wouldn't think trick roping would be the next frontier of physics. But when you study what physicists call elastic rods, some of your other choices include chains, whips, and curly hair. Besides, lassos hadn't been studied very much. Until a French doctoral student in applied mathematics decided to investigate the mechanics of the lasso. In applied mathematics, the real world is important, so he recruited a professional roper from Disneyland, Paris. And he learned to do one of the simple tricks himself. Then he analyzed the whole thing mathematically and even made a robot that could do the flat rope trick. Mostly what he found was what ropers already know. The flat rope trick is physically possible. But the real purpose was not to prove the obvious, but to understand the math that underlies the real world. He did find that the loop needs to be 75% of the total length of the rope. And the roper's hand doesn't lead the loop, it's in phase with it. We always knew that the flat rope trick worked. Now we know why at a level we'd never reached before.